The writer for today is Sheridan Voicy, and the reading is entitled Facing the Battle. Not long ago, I met up with a group of friends. As I listened to the conversation, it seemed like everyone in the room was facing some significant battle. Two of us had parents fighting cancer. One had a child with an eating disorder. Another friend was experiencing chronic pain. And another was facing major surgery. It seemed a lot for a bunch of people in their 30s and 40s. First Chronicles 16 recounts a key moment in Israel's history when the Ark of the Covenant was brought into the city of David or Jerusalem. Samuel tells us it happened in a moment of peace between battles. When the Ark was in place, symbolizing God's presence, David led the people in a song. Together, the nation sang of God's wonder-working power, His promise-keeping ways, and His past protection. Look to the Lord and His strength, they cried out in chapter 16. Seek His face always. They'd need to, because more battles were coming. Look to the Lord and His strength. Seek His face. That's not bad advice to follow when illness, family concerns, and other battles confront us, because we haven't been left to fight in our own waning energies. God is present. God is strong. He's looked after us in the past and will do so again. Our God will get us through.